Hey what's up guys, No Nonsense here, bringing you another Warface Global Operations video. What you're seeing now is pretty much just a normal day for me in Plant the Bomb, killing and killing. But I'm about to make it so much harder for myself because I'm going to turn everything off. <laughs> Yep, you heard that right. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go through my HUD and I'm going to change the opacity of every single button to zero. But first, I need to turn auto fire off and also aim assist. Now I'm going to go back and turn all of these down to nothing. Now in COD Mobile, when you change the opacity down to zero, it leaves just a little bit for you to see. But in Warface, it doesn't. So let's see how I get on. So I've put together some games where it, literally I cannot see a thing. So all of the buttons that I'm pressing is where I think I remember they are. Uh, through the next couple of games you're going to see me do some really stupid stuff because I just can't remember where the buttons are. I'm also going to watch these games along with you and just commentate along uh, with the games because I really can't remember what I did. Oh there's a guy over there. Ah, uh, and I get sniped. So whilst I'm recording the voiceover, I'm actually listening to the game in some HyperX Cloud 2s and I don't usually play with headphones on whilst playing this, so I'm actually hearing sounds now that I wouldn't normally whilst I'm playing. But the grenade throws and um, explosions and the sniper shots that just happened before in the previous round, I could hear in my left ear. So it probably would be handy to wear headphones whilst playing this game. If anyone actually does, uh, let me know down in the comments. I am really struggling here without um, auto fire and aim assist. I mean, the aim assist really does help you in this game because I'm literally just flailing around the screen on 100% sensitivity. Like, there's no assist whatsoever. It does not lock on to anybody. You literally just have to shoot in the person's general direction and hope that they take damage. Um, I also need to remind you that if you look at the screen, the only things you can see in terms of HUD-wise are the map and the joystick. Unfortunately you can't actually turn these two off. It would have been awesome if you could and just literally just played a full hardcore game but like aiming in, switching, reloading, all of that stuff is done just purely by muscle memory. And uh, I also can't remember sometimes where the aim and the fire buttons are so if I randomly start crouching or aiming or shooting in a random direction and I die again from the same guy as well in spawn then <laughs> go back to what I was talking before if you see me just randomly shooting in the air, then it's because I can't actually find the crouch button or the aim. There we go, look, I'm just shooting a wall for some reason. Ooh, I'm sneaky sneaks. Hopefully I can get up behind this guy and take him out if I remember where the aim button, well, not the aim button, sorry, but the fire button is because I'm just crouched and aimed. I'm just going to stay like this until I find the guy. There he is. Please don't mess this up for the team. Oh, up. Oh, there we go, randomly firing. Oh, no. Ooh, too, oh, not bad. Not bad. Oh, uh, oh, uh, there we go. oh, got an assist. There's a guy beside me that's grenaded the guy. Oh, I mean, that is. <laughs> oh my god, this is so hard. Come on, take him out, take him out, take him out. Yes, oh, oh we're going to do this. We're gonna do oh, it's just me versus one other guy. There he is. Shoot, shoot. Oh, not too, oh it's too late, too late. You've already seen you taking you out. Okay, so next match. Uh, oh, this is really, oh, look, what am I doing? If you saw this, like, if you were, if you died and you spectated someone and, like, I apologise if you spectated me and wondered what the hell I was doing. You can see I have no idea what I'm doing. I'm trying to fire, but can't find the button. I remember thinking to myself that the fire button must be, if I aim just to the right of my holographic, so I should be able to do this, but, I just, look, I just, I just really can't. This is super hard to do and it's going to take me out. Oh, oh, come on. They need to turn this into a brawl game at least. I mean, they, they have a brawl manual fire only, but they don't have a brawl you can't see anything try killing someone game. Or maybe they should make a hardcore mode, which is pretty much like this, but you don't get to see a radar either. Um, maybe the joystick needs to move as well. I mean, you don't actually need to see the joystick circle because you know where you're going. Okay, so I've switched to a shotgun. This might be uh, tactical in terms of literally just get in front of someone and start shooting. Ah, uh, no, that didn't work. Yeah, I think I just held down the fire button and just let it go. Ah, uh, it didn't help me whatsoever. I need to get closer. Also, might need to aim in. Maybe that will help me out a little bit. All that guy's lagging in me. That's weird. Um, th there I am. There, just trying it. There we go. Come on, crouchy sneaks, they're aiming. It's such a weird rectangle for a shotgun. Oh, no. 
Oh, oh, <laughs> I've, let, oh I've lost the fire button. No, grenade. Oh dear. I literally just needed to hold down the button like I did in the previous round and I would have killed that guy. Although there were two other people at the top of that hill so I probably wouldn't have survived. Uh, I just realised this probably isn't going to help my KD too much because I'm just going to die loads. However, we are playing Plant the Bomb, so it's only really one death per round. It's not like I'm playing Team Deathmatch where I'm dying like 40 times. I have a feeling that this Werrick 2 XQ is a bot. Maybe this Moshi isn't, uh, but we're somehow we won that round. I have no idea how. I'm sorry, I'm not really putting anything into this game. Uh, I'm just having a bit of fun. And by fun, I mean I'm actually crying inside. So it's one round each. I've been carried by my team. Weirdly enough, oh, there's a guy right there. Is he there or is he just... Oh, there he is actually there. Oh, come on. Oh, I got an assist. Thank you, teammate, because I was doing very poor there. It's now 3v3. Can I still be as useful as I was before? Oh, apparently not. Someone's shooting me and... No. No. There's no way. Okay, well, we lost that round. Let's... What am I doing now? Am I going bottom again? Oh, am I going to try for a grenade? In? Yes, I... Oh, look at that. Beautiful. Beautiful and smooth. Oh, there's a guy there. He's in my radar. Someone behind me as well. Uh, I'm getting shot from behind. I'm just going to randomly shoot. Uh, <laughs> okay, we need to do something about this HUD. What I'm going to do is I'm going to bring back the um, the aim and fire buttons. I'm, I'm, I'm not going to put the opacity up. I'm just moving them into the screen now just so that I can kind of remember where they are. I'm going to put the aim button on the left and the fire on the right. I am going to move the opacity back down for the next game. Okay, so we're playing Italy. I've still got my shotgun out. Italy is almost all close quarters, so I might be lucky here. Uh, this guy's not seeing me. Come on, come on. Oh, we killed each other. Jeez. We lost that round. Let's try again. Uh, okay, we're going right this time. Uh, throw grenade. I don't know where my grenade button is. Okay, it looks like I gave up. Oh, although a grenade through there would have been really good. Oh, I'm just friendly firing. Maybe just randomly firing is the trick on this game. Uh, <laughs> no it's not. Okay, round two. I'm switching to my sniper apparently. No, I'm not. I'm probably just forgetting or remembering where the buttons are to switch weapons. Okay, maybe let's go for the sniper. Oh, oh I've crouched. Oh, I look serious now. Aim in. Oh, there we go. So, sniping... Ah, uh, I swear I hit him then. Sniping with uh, manual fire is going to be hard because you have to aim and fire with the same thump. Oh, come on, you need to get him. Come on, you can get him. <laughs> yes! Oh, I shot 20 times and I hit him once with a headshot. That's good. Um, that's all of them, isn't it? Yeah, I've killed them all. Well, not me, the team. I, I got one guy. Hey, look at that. Okay, so this is super hard to play when you cannot see a HUD. It's literally just you guessing where things are on the screen. Uh, if anyone else wants to give this a go and does, uh, film it, let me know. I'll go in and give it a watch. Uh, but uh, even watching myself is cringy, so I hope you do better than me. It's currently 2v2. I'm randomly shooting into nowhere. It's probably because I'm either trying to reload or de-scope my sniper. Oh, it's me. Me v2. Come on, clutch it. Clutch it. Slap them all. Oh, 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 oh. Come on. Yes, come on. Right, 1v1. 1v1 me, bro. <laughs> what are you doing? Switch. There we go. Come on. Come on. You can do this. You can do this. He's right there. He's right there. Come on. They clap him. No. Oh. Come on. You're going for the defuse. Oh, he's right there though. What are you doing? What are you doing, me? Ah, oh, I lost the one with you on the headshotted. Jeez. Anywho, that was a good game. Seem to have switched back to my assault rifle for this one. I'm doing a little bit better. I was going to say a little bit better, but no. Thank you so much for getting this far in the video. This was just for a bit of fun. There weren't any real tips in this video, but if you want to give this a go, turn down all of your HUD, turn off auto aim and put on manual fire if you don't already and have some fun with it. It's not going to be very good for your KD, but meh, who cares, right? This is the end of this for me. I'll see you in the next one.